Hey guys, one more quick video with the Leica M9. Thought I'd just run through the controls quickly. Um, it's a, a lot more basic than an SLR, so this shouldn't take too long. Basically, on the top of the camera here, manual aperture ring, focus ring, these are on all the lenses, hyperfocal scale here to, uh, to help you focus nice and quickly. And then on the top of the camera itself, you got a shutter button, off position. This is continuous shooting mode, so you can hear it's, it's not the speediest camera, but there you go, that's, that's continuous. And then single shot mode. And then the final position there is timer. So then you have this dial here. Uh, this is pretty simple as well. A, which is uh, for automatic, and that is an aperture priority mode. Obviously, you set the aperture with the ring there. Then you have all the various shutter speeds. Four thousandth of a second is the fastest. That turns all the way down. And then you have one second, two seconds, four seconds, eight, and then bulb. So when you have it on bulb setting, obviously, you hold it in. Oh. Got it on timer there, but if you have it on bulb, then you hold it in and it'll take as long an exposure as you want if you're doing some nighttime shots. On the back of the camera, then, um, four position jog dial, I guess. Um, there is a dedicated button for ISO, so you hold the button down for ISO and then select the ISO using the, the jog dial here. Um, if you take in a picture and you press play, then hitting info will get you to the screen that shows the, the histogram and all the shooting information. Um, what else have we got here? Main menu button on the side there. This has pretty much all the standard features you'd find on, on any camera these days. Um, another good one here is the info button. This brings up a quick display so on the top it shows you a percentage gauge of how much battery life there is and then the one below it percentage of how much of your SD card is full remaining pictures what more what uh, shutter speed you're in right now and then it also tells you which lens you have attached as long as you have the Leica M mount lenses that have a 6-bit coding on them which tells the camera which of the lenses you're using um, what else we got there's a set button as well, the set one down the bottom here. This one has uh, some of the the shooting settings. So we've got white balance, uh, compression settings for either a DNG or a JPEG uh, resolution. So it's set at 18 megapixels right now. Exposure exposure compensation bracketing, and then for uh, another option for setting up profiles. Now, exposure bracketing as well. You can set that up so that a, a half press of the shutter button and a rotation of this dial will dial in plus or minus uh, on the bracketing like most cameras. Um, on the side here, USB port. That is the the only port that there is. Um, everything else is pretty simple. Now on the bottom of the camera, let's flick this up. Quick half turn and here we have your SD card slot in there and battery in there. Quite small batteries um, seem to last seem to last a few hours of fairly intensive shooting. If you were having a day wandering around somewhere, you are definitely going to need to grab a couple of batteries though. Uh, quick half turn of that locks it back together, and that is the Leica M9.